and Clats. I am here with our crew for this trip. It's actually been exactly a week now since we left on our last trip. We are back in Jerusalem and we're heading off to the central station so we can go to En Gedi where we were last year, where all the Ibex were in the middle of the desert. Right, Mika? Check it out. We're back in town, baby. We're here. We're back in the middle of the desert. And we're hopefully going to see some wild ibex today and hike a really nice mountain. As you see over here, that's where the river starts up. Or we're heading into one of these. From what you can see, this is like there's like a crest over here. And then down there is the Dead Sea. And everything gets like radically lower. It's because Israel used to be covered completely in water. And this is one of the remainders from what it used to be, the three main water sources in Israel, like the Dead Sea, the Kinneret and Tiberias, and the Red Sea, were all connected in one big ocean. We found the Ibexes. Check those guys out. Here we go, some close encounters right now. Check this out. Little babies. It's amazing. Look how beautiful they are. They're getting ready to bolt. Hey class, last time you saw me here, I was running in the walls. Doing... So today I'm going to show you guys how to survive. Again, part seven. As you can see, like in all wild adventures, I've gotten myself in quite a sticky situation. I can't get down. I can't get down. What shall I do? Well, the first thing, if you're planning on being stuck for hours, to find yourself a source of food. Now this food has to be hy hyperhygienic. Any type of plant matter will do. These are called the edible kashi root. Hyperhygienic. Hyperhygienic. Oh. As you can see, now that I found my source of food and I'm nourished, I have to find myself a source of water. Look at that. Hyperhygienic. Oh my gosh! We found it! As you guys remember, last year I taught you guys how to scale cliffs. We're going to use the same procedure this year. Just lower yourself with all the might that you know. Wow! Mmm, fresh, fresh drinking water. See you guys next time. <laughs> Starting like the real parts of the hike right now. We're heading into the deeper water. And up the waterfalls. It's honestly, if you guys ever been to Israel, if you've come to Israel, this needs to be like your first destination. This is like the most fun place. I don't know if you guys remember this, but this is where a little hidden waterfall is. That's not really hidden. But that little slide that we did last year. Check it out. We're about to have some real real chill sessions in here.
over here has ended. How was it, boys? It's on me. What would you rate me on trip reviewer out of 6.9? Negative 4. And? Plus 100, minus 200. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it was amazing actually. It yeah. was great, great experience. Yes, it was good trip, guys. Come here if you want to explore some Dead Sea. If you want to put your life into the risk, especially. It's a good place, guys. Come here, check it out. We're going to go catch a bus now to Jerusalem and then uh, head back down to Tel Aviv.